Now, I want to talk about brunette Dorit. How did we get here? What inspired you to dip over to the slightly darker side? Because we're kind of in a honey bronze moment. Yes, yes. That's, you know, that's right, Evan. I, I just felt like I needed a change. You know, being blonde, it's very high maintenance. And I'm so high maintenance as it is, I just feel like my hair should not be as high maintenance. <laughs> Do you feel different? Do you feel like it's impacted your style? Do, is, is this a new Dorit? I don't think it's a new me, but I think that I'm exploring other, uh, ele other elements of my style. But I think it's really, listen, my style is representative of my mood and how I'm feeling, truly. Um, I, I, you know, I dress myself, I, I source everything, and I don't know why I take this, you know, upon myself and create more work for myself, but I'm so particular about it. So I think the brown hair for me, it's really just, I needed a change, I wanted something fresh, I wanted something different, and it felt like, you know what, it's about time. I don't know if you saw, but when fans first got a glimpse of the brown hair on social media, there were these Ariana Grande comparisons, and I think the ponytail had something to do with it. What do you think of the Ariana comparisons? Did she, was she inspiration at all for you? Um, well, you know, I hate to say no, because she's so adorable, but no, I wasn't thinking about her when I decided to go brown, but of course I was flattered. I mean, who wouldn't be? You know, and since we're so close in age, I can understand how people would actually compare us. Right, right. It's, it's like a month or two apart, something like both that. Both have beautiful voices. Hello. Avi. Yeah. Yes. Mine just, I haven't, you know, I didn't want to outshine Ariana, so I'm waiting until she kind of decides it's ready for me to come out.